You keep creating video content but somehow don't manage to keep your audience interested until the end of the video? Then stay tuned because in this video I will teach you how to make engaging video content and I will show you with actionable tips how you can keep your audience interested until the very end of the video. And I suggest you stay until the very end of this video because after the list of super actionable tips I will share with you a whole playlist on YouTube SEO, YouTube optimization and mistakes to not make in YouTube in 2020. Hey everyone, I'm Chiara from Semras and in this video we'll see together how to make engaging video content for your users and your audience. Now the first tip is to hook the user from the very beginning. As you may have noticed my intro was clear and direct to the point. Why you're here, what you learned that you didn't know before and why you should stay until the very end. Until the end of the video. Then stay tuned because in this video I will teach you how to make engaging video content and I will show you with actionable tips how you can keep your audience interested until the very end of the video. So don't waste your time explaining who you are, what your job title is, the first 10 seconds of the videos are crucial and they literally are a matter of life and death. Not like really life and death, but death of your watch time and death of traffic to your videos. So really make sure that you can hook the users from the very beginning, first 10 seconds. The second tip is to research a topic to find the most relevant keywords for your title. The title is fundamental. You have to generate at least a few title ideas and check their search volumes before you even start recording your videos. For example, for this video specifically, I consider the primary keywords video, engaging video and video content. I've checked them out in Summer's keyboard overview and took the one that you see now. The keyword video by itself was just too hard to tackle. It's too generic and too broad. It answers too many questions and queries. If you Google it, in fact, in the SERP, you'll find music videos and all sorts of videos that don't actually answer the specific question I'm trying to answer with this video, which is how to make engaging video content. That's why I decided to go for video content as my target keyword, but I also tried to get the search volume of engaging videos by adding the adjective engaging to my title. The third tip is to use time trigger cards. This will be extremely helpful in keeping people on your channel interested in your content and providing them with related video content to what they're watching right now. For example, if you want to know more about keyword research, how to do it and how to find the best keywords for your videos, well, here's a little card for you with suggestions on how to do keyword research. So I suggest you click the link that you have seen above my head. Now the fourth tip is to use timestamps. In fact, user experience is not only important on websites, it's also extremely crucial on videos. If you provide your audience with timestamps, they will already be able to see the key points and the crucial parts of your videos. Like what we have here. This will help users understand and get the general idea about the content faster and it will increase your chances to appear in the YouTube search results. And yes, I know, some people say that putting timestamps decreases your watch time, which is not what we want. But let me tell you something, the most important thing when you're making a video or when you're generally making content is to provide people with value. If they like what they saw in your video, even if they watch 8 minutes out of 13, they will watch another video and your watch time will be increased by that action. So yes, I'm in the timestamps team. Let me know in the comments if you're in the no timestamps team. Number five is to always have captions on your videos. According to a new report from Verizon Media and Ad Buyer Publix Media, a survey of US consumers found that 92% view videos with the sound off on mobile and 83% watch videos with sound off in general. Forgot your headphones at home, you're putting your kids to sleep. Why the audios are going super horrible like that? Yeah, I bet you didn't like that, right? I didn't like making that either, I'm sorry. But yes, audio is the most important thing in video. I know it sounds crazy, but it is because you would be willing to listen to me if you didn't see me that well. You would not be able to stay until the end of the video if you didn't hear me well. 
So that's extremely important and always put attention to that aspect. Moreover, text captions will also make your video much better visible for the search engines because the more written content you give Google, the more Google will index it and rank it. Number six is to always ask people to subscribe. From our channel experience, people are subscribing to our latest videos over three times more often now that we ask them to do so and keep our subscribe button visible at all time. And in case you missed it, here's the button if you feel like it, subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell so that you never miss the content that will be posted around marketing and just in general the digital world. So yeah, that's how you make engaging videos and that's how you keep your audience interested until the very end. And if you appreciated the video, click the like button, subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell. And yes, of course I didn't forget about my promise, here is the playlist that I promised you about YouTube. Uh, I don't know where I'm gonna put it yet, but it's somewhere, it's gonna appear around me, you'll see it in the screen. Uh, thank you so much and please again subscribe to the channel to make us understand that we're going the right way. I really hope you enjoyed this video and you found it useful, if so, let me know in the comments below. I'll see you in the next one, thank you so much for listening, ciao!